Hello gang, game only go Dan here! How you going? We're back in the Elder Scrolls Online in the Dragon Hole DLC. About to talk to Katina, we're just outside this delve right here. Oh, sorry. I barely saw you there. Can I help you? Wait, where are my manners? Katina Garana, daughter to Consul Ornaria. Former Consul, I should say. She passed recently. I'm rambling. Sorry. My head, it's just... I haven't been sleeping well. Well, you're clearly exhausted. Is everything alright? Honestly? No. Far from it. I find myself plagued by unsettling dreams. Every night since my mother died, my mind returns to this place. I see a man scribbling a letter. I hold my mother's necklace out to him. His eyes turn to me. And I wake. This place looks dangerous. Do you plan to go inside? I... I don't know. I just can't shake the feeling that my mother has unfinished business in the Citadel. Something to do with her necklace and that man. Perhaps you could take the necklace inside for me? It's the key to this mystery. I know it. Fair enough. Give me the necklace. I'll help you sort out this mystery. I can't tell you how grateful I am for your assistance. A woman in my position can't afford to fall asleep at state dinners. And my mother. She should be resting peacefully in Aetherius. Not calling out for help from beyond the grave. Tell me more about these dreams. Are they always the same? I can never recall the beginnings. But they always end the same. I'm standing outside the Citadel, just as we are now. Suddenly, I'm inside. I walk down a dank hallway that opens into a larger chamber. Then, I spot him at his writing desk. The man. Can you describe him? Hmm. Wary. Troubled, certainly. Consumed by some secret resentment. I approach to get a better look at him. His hand drifts to a stop. Without even thinking about it, I hold out my mother's necklace. Urging him to take it, I suppose. But he doesn't? No. His eyes flick upward to look at me. Tired, reddening eyes. Much like mine, in fact. We stare at each other for a moment. Then I wake in a cold sweat. I know it sounds simple, but there's an anguish there I can't even begin to describe. Okay. Gonna knock me down, but not knock me off the off the bridge here. Right. I gotta enter this place somehow. I guess it ain't through the front door. Nice little drop here. Ooh, onto the rocks! Formerly known as the Topol Legionary Academy, this venerable structure produced some of the Akaviri Potante's greatest commanders. Now, little more than ghost stories haunt its interior. Find the letter. I remember these halls. Once proud, now ruined. All because of me. Please, help me make things right. 
Seek out the library. A letter from my beloved rests upon a writing desk. My atonement begins there. Dear sir, I regret to inform you that I must delay or otherwise revise the protective ritual we discussed last turdus. An essential contributing party, the battle mage Honoria Garana, deserted last night. Had she left unencumbered, I might have been able to find a mage of comparable skill to complete the ritual without her. Alas, she took the primary reagent with her, leaving us in dire straits indeed. I formally request that a tribunal be convened to discuss this treachery and devise an appropriate punishment for Garana, should she be found. I place my hand upon the diamond and swear to you that I will make every effort to perform the ritual despite this hardship. I would be remiss if I did not reiterate my admonition from before. Certain aspects of this spell teeter on the brink of necromantic practice. Practice. Magic that influences or otherwise alters the soul always carries risk, but as we discussed, the threat of not an infection, by my estimation, poses a far greater threat to the academy students and faculty. Conducting the ritual without Garana's reagent poses a higher risk of failure, but we must take action, lest the fate of Centurion Vitulialas Lassius spread to other occupants of the academy. May the eight bless this endeavor and our beloved empire. Your servant, battle mage, Jano Invel. And that's to the honorable commandant, Aquila Paltrasius. Right. Who are you? What are you doing here? Jano. Have you come to plunder what remains of our academy? It matters little. Whatever indignities you plan to visit upon these halls will pale against the curse I put on them. Who are you? Did you write this letter? I am Jano Invel, Imperial Battle Mage and Spellcraft Instructor. And yes, I wrote that letter. What is this about? After 20 years of imprisonment, I won't suffer idle conversation. Speak plainly or leave. Katina Garana sent me. My mother Honoria. Honoria? Gave her this necklace. Do you recognize it? Garana? By the eight. Yes. I recognize both the name and the locket. That piece of jewelry was to serve as the focus for a soul warding spell. We meant to use it to keep us safe from the flu. But then Honoria left, taking the necklace with her. You mentioned a curse. Could this locket break it somehow? I hesitate to hope. But yes. Yes, perhaps it could. After Honoria left with the locket, I attempted to craft new focuses. Totems made of Honoria's treasured objects. All three attempts failed. And the result? Well, look around. How can I help? That locket should guide you to other totems bound to the same spell. You must destroy those corrupted totems. They bind our souls to the failed warding ritual. Once they're destroyed, return to me with a locket. Then I can mend what's broken. Why do you think Onaria left? She had doubts, certainly. We all did. But at a certain point, it seems she lost faith in the ritual completely. I was furious at first. I even called for her to be arrested on charges of desertion. Or would have. Had I sent that letter. Nonaria's daughter suffers vivid dreams of you writing that letter. No great surprise there. That was the longest, most agonizing night of my life. I never sent the letter, though. I didn't have the heart to. Alright, let's find these corrupted totems. And I imagine a sky shot as well. Jano was so desperate to save these people, and I let him down. Still, Jano doesn't know why I left. 
Why I had to protect the very thing that was more important than even myself. If only I would have told him. Yep. Yep. Weird. Why did that come up? Just keep looking that way. <laughs> no thanks. I should came this way to have a look if there was a sky shot around here. First totem. I could still do this with or without Gloria. I just need objects she treasured. She polished this sword once support me. It will work. It has to. He worked so hard, but he forgot a critical point. The item had to bind us together. The two of us. Gods, I am so sorry, Jano. Oh, which way are we going? I'll have a look if it changes again once we go over here. That was pointing me in this direction before. Yep, this is it. valued your privacy, Anoria. Maybe this will be enough. Your worries, your joys, your secret desires. Another legionary fell ill today. My diary wasn't enough. If he had just read it, he would have known why I left. For once, Jano, I wish you would have pried. Okay, 
Next place is in here. As soon as I can get rid of these clowns. Stay at max melee distance. Oh, Commandant Weston. Oh, let's go. Oh, he's got friends. Is that? Where's the final totem? It's up top somewhere. Right, well, that's that, but where's the sky shard? Toys. Did you clutch this as a child? I, I have to try. Damn you for leaving me, Honoria. Damn you! I sewed that doll with my own hands. A gift for our child. For Jano's child. He never suspected that I bore his daughter in my womb. Too busy. Always too busy. The ritual. The soul binding. I couldn't risk the life of our child on a spell like that. So I left. Damn my cowardice. I left without saying goodbye. But now, we can make things right. Okay, return to Jano. Let's have a look at the other side. Maybe there's another room. Don't like the fire, do you, little rat? What's this? A stolen scrap from a priceless Kaji tapestry. Okay.
Didn't see the sky shot out there. So there's all this that we haven't looked through yet. Check this side. Like that, he couldn't. I couldn't actually jump up to do my ultimate, so it just it came out like a big, like a thunder stomp or something. <laughs> ah, there you are, down the sewers. the sky shard now we'll just keep guess I'll go back I oh know we'll keep going forward going this way Jana's above you have any questions before we try this? Thank the Eight you're back. Did you destroy all three totems? I pray you did. I already feel the binding ward loosening. If we dispel the magics on the locket, our souls should find peace at last. Yes, I destroyed all the totems. How do we dispel the magic on the locket? Drop the locket into the flame. My grip on the Mundus is weak at best. But I managed to conjure this fire while you were away. It should burn away any arcane energy still clinging to the necklace. Once those magics dissipate, Aetherius awaits. Some aspect of Honori Honoria remains tied to this locket. Will burning it burn her as well? She knows what breaking the curse requires. Whatever happens, I trust she's prepared. Place the locket in the flame, my friend. Is it really you? Cartina chooses her allies well. That's my clever girl. Finally, our spirits can rest. Finally. What happens now? Now, I try to reconcile with the man I betrayed. I will try to contact Katina one last time before we drift to Aetherius. But if I can't, tell her I love her. More than anything. I'm sorry I caused her such distress. What should I tell her about Jano? Tell her the truth. Her father wanted to save everyone despite the risks. I wanted to keep her safe. 
Jano and I both made mistakes. Pride and stubbornness. Cowardice and heartache. But now, we can make things right. We can find peace. If we broke the curse, why do all these undead remain? Flesh always proves sluggish and stubborn. These corpses may wander these halls for a while longer, but I assure you, their souls are free of the curse and will find their way to Aetherius very soon. Fair enough. I'll tell Katina what I have witnessed. I'm sorry I left you when you needed me, my love. It was cowardly. But there's something I must tell you. The reason I fled. What possible reason could you have? We could have saved these people, Honoria. Why? Why did you leave me? Come with me, Jano. Let me show you before we fade away. Okay, back to Katina. That's what I thought. Oh, she's down here. Katina. Thank the eight. You're back. What did you discover? Is my mother's soul at rest? Yes, your mother found relief. The dreams should stop. She told me to tell you she loves you. What a relief. On both counts. Did you discover the cause of her distress? What troubled her? A man named Jano Inver needed your mother's help casting a spell. She left, and the spell failed. And that spell became a curse. The curse that's afflicted the Academy these 20 years. Of course. But I don't understand. Why would mother leave this man in his hour of need? The woman I knew would never abandon a friend. She feared what the spell would do to you. You rested in her womb at the time. Janna was your father. My father? But how? I'll need some time to process all this. I can't believe she bore the weight of this all these years. In any event, thank you for helping her. I hope the two of them find a way to reconcile in Aetherius. Her and my father. Glad I could be of service. I should really get some sleep, but with all that's happened, I don't know how I could manage it. Secrets from my mother's past, a father I never knew. It's a lot to take in. In any event, thank you so much for all your efforts. Eight bless you. Honoria, who is this? This is your daughter, Jano. Katina. This is why I left. The ritual posed too high a risk for an unborn child. I tried to tell you so many times, but you were so busy and I was a coward. Katina, I had no idea. She has your eyes, Honoria. And your stubbornness, my love. Which is why I knew she would find a way to help us. I should have told you. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Thank you for showing her to me. I... I only wish I had more time. I think I'll rest here a moment before I head back to Central. It's the first rest I've had in weeks. It really is something, isn't it? What's something? The Citadel. You don't see Grand Imperial edifices like this outside of Cyrodiil very often. Perhaps we can reclaim it. If we manage to rid it of undead, we might rebuild. Learn its history. That would make my parents proud. I know it. It sure would. Alright, Katina. I'll leave you. We are gonna go back to the Pride Home Way Shrine. 
once we get there, we're going to take a trip back to Z Jasim. And then hand that quest in. 